morning, everyone. It is, what day is it? Wednesday. If you don't know me, my name is Sammy. I work at Disneyland. Thank you for joining my vlog. I am in the parking lot of the gym currently. I really didn't want to record today, but I'm going to do it anyways because these are going to be the memories I look back on. Tonight, I'm working an overnight shift at Disneyland. The latest I've ever worked at Disneyland ever. I'm doing it today and tomorrow. My shift is 8 to 4.30 a.m. <sighs> I tried to sleep in. It's 9.22. I'm very much on a going to bed early, waking up early schedule. But today I got out of bed at like, or I woke up at 7, got out of bed at 8. And now I'm at the gym procrastinating and it's 9.30. Okay, and this is where I shot myself in the foot, y'all. Is that my New Year's resolution is to start over my caffeine intake. So I'm doing two months no caffeine. And if I want to known that I was doing two months no caffeine with these two overnight shifts 4 30 a.m I will be getting home at 5 a.m to go to sleep tomorrow I would not have done the caffeine cleanse and you know what? I feel great but I committed so I have to stay committed I think I want to go to the library and edit my last YouTube video which by the way I feel so freaking ugly editing my last video I'm like crap like why is my face so round like why I look so ugly without makeup and so that's why my motivation was low to film today. I still am sore from my workout Monday which I hit legs on Monday and it was so heavy. So I think I'm just gonna do the 12 3 30 in ab circuit and then go sit in the sauna for maybe 20 minutes this time. Anyways let's go to the gym y'all. <laughs> So I ended up picking up Chick-fil-A because we're on our save our money grind and I had a gift card and then um, I got a root beer and then I realized that this root beer has caffeine in it but it has like barely any so I'm just going to drink it. Why do we have to put stimulants in everything? Also, I've been drinking poppy like crazy. Poppy has caffeine in it. Only like 30 milligrams, but still, I'm like, I'm trying to do no caffeine, and I'm letting those little things slide. The poppies can slide, you know. Okay. Let's eat, get ready, and then figure out what we're going to do today because it's only 11. We have to go to work at 8. This is the worst the rest of my Chick-fil-A ice and my favorite glass. I got these for me and my roommates on Amazon from for Christmas. I just want another soda. So this time we're doing the Poppy Doc Pop. Oh crap. Look at me trying. That's good. That's good. I just filmed my updated curly hair routine. Right now I'm letting my hair air dry and I could either do my nails, go to the library and edit my newest YouTube video. And then I definitely need to take a nap sometime soon. I think I'm gonna do my nails first. Done that she was anxious. She doesn't like being picked up. Also, this is the funny thing about nails. I literally did press-ons yesterday. No, Sunday, it's Tuesday. Went to work yesterday. All of them came off. I did forget a step. I forgot to put on a slip layer before putting the actual nail on. If you know, you know. And so I was working with my bestie Baymax and all my nails came off. And I picked the rest off on the drive home. They were really cute. They were like pink chrome. And I think I'm just gonna do my natural nails. Do like navy chrome. We'll see. Okay, shit. Oh, my hair is like drying extra slow today but um what i do is i let it like completely dry and harden and then i fluff it out so it'll just kind of look like this till it's done air drying but anyway we got a comfy fit on i'm just wearing leggings commerce and a hoodie and i have my bag packed we're going to go to the library today and I haven't gone to the library probably since spring last year so it's almost been a year and like I have a library card and I kind of want to rent a book and maybe like sit and um, edit my YouTube video my last YouTube video that I really want to post and so we're gonna go do that for an hour come back take a nap and go to work I think I feel like everyone needs to have at least one fill a day, right? I go to the library, stunning. Only my second time there. 
stunning. I found the perfect spot, as you saw, with the beautiful fig fiddle leaf fig trees in front of me. Sit down. I'm editing. I don't get into. T I don't get ten minutes into editing till my laptop shuts off. Did I bring a charger? No, it was dead. So then I spent the rest of the time wandering around, trying to like kind of get more familiar with the library. And I was like, I'm gonna check out some books. And this girl does not know how to choose. I'm so indecisive. I can't even pick like favorites, like my favorite color, I don't have one. Favorite movie, don't have one. Like I'm just so indecisive and it's so bad. So I just did a lap, walked around and pieced out. I think I'm going to study here for an hour in bed. I'll put on like something background and then I'm going to take a nap and then we're going to pack my snacks for work because I'm not, I think I'm going to eat before I go. And I think I'm just going to bring a ton of snacks. I'm like, I'm not gonna eat a full meal at 3 a.m., you know, or even 1 a.m. The vibes are vibing. Alrighty, y'all, it is finally time to get ready for work. I did not take a nap. I just couldn't fall asleep. I did eat dinner and I did make I have the skin softening on here. I feel like it looks bad. Let me turn it off. All right, that's a little better, but I need to put powder on my face. One sec. Okay, as I was saying, I could not take a nap. I got in the editing mood. I almost have my video done editing for YouTube. Starting off, starting off the day, or the year good so far with as far as YouTube goes, but Ooh, we are mad. Um, let's get dressed for work. And then I'm going to show you guys everything I'm going to bring. Sorry, the lighting just sucks. So we're just going to work with it. Starting off, I wear these black dickies. And I'm actually going to keep on my leggings because it makes them more comfortable. And it's cold. Next up, we have this blue button-down shirt. My Seat belt, belt. Snatch it in. I always put my company ID on my belt. We have this cute little BB-8 thing that I got on Amazon in a pack. Name tag, a cute name tag. Above this, I'm going to put a black sweatshirt. A little story, we could pick our characters. I couldn't decide between Baby Yoda and Baymax, or Grogu and Baymax. So I didn't decide, and then it was too late. So I have Mickey Mouse. And I could have exchanged them, but again, I can't decide between the two. So I'm just gonna keep the Mickey Mouse. I mean, this is the one I've worn forever, so yeah. But soon it's gonna switch to hometown, so I'm kind of sad. Cause I rather, cause I think um, the characters are a better like conversation starter. Next we have my super beat up Doc Martens. And I will be keeping my fuzzy socks. I'm gonna extra layer up because it's late. And it's cold, y'all. So this is the look. But you know what? We're comfy. We're gonna slay this shift. Okay, now time to pack the bag. I'm not gonna bring my laptop, but I'm gonna bring my iPad. And this, I transfer from bag to bag. It just literally has anything you could need lotion airpods hand sanitizer clips like this is my go-to everything bag that i just switch from bag to bag all right my roommates are home and out and about so i don't want to like disturb them so i'm going to show you guys what i'm bringing snacks wise because that's the most important part right what's in my lunchbox cheeses pretzels these are so good they're like s'mores clusters from costco Hummus and celery. I could also eat this with my thing. Another soda. <laughs> and then a yogurt parfait. It's like yogurt, blueberries, granola, chia seeds. And so those are my snacks for the night. Nothing like too heavy. And I doubt I'll eat all of this, but it's just nice to have the option. So this is my black long chomp. I think it fits everything. I don't remember what it's called. But I've literally had it since like high school um i put little lace bows on them i don't know they're like i need to make them like shorter or something 
So this is everything. I'm also bringing, these are so good from Trader Joe's. That's garbage. And I also have all these little Marvel Valentines that I'm gonna eventually give out. I'll put this in my everything pouch. First things first, lunchbox. I always have to get my bag checked, so I always make sure the zippers are on this side. Not to be extra, but to be extra. My everything pouch, my iPad, my Stanley water bottle. I really like this one because it doesn't leak everywhere. And then my chocolates. And that is it, y'all. We're ready to go. I will check back in with you guys when I get off. Hopefully I'm still alive by then. Hello, it is. Guys, I actually did pretty well once it hit 3 a.m. That's when I was falling asleep. And we actually finished everything before two, so we were like looking for stuff to do. So actually, because we finished so early, they moved our shift tomorrow from six to 2.10. And I'm actually really glad, because I don't know if I can do another night of this, because I know I won't be able to sleep in tomorrow. But let's see, I'm gonna get ready for bed ASAP. I'm not even gonna pretend like I'm turning off the light. Okay, I'm just gonna go straight to bed. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow nighty. Good morning. I only slept five hours, but I feel like the eye mask thing really helped. I don't know what I'm gonna do today. We'll see. Gym fit. I feel like a scrub and I feel like I'm moving in slow motion today and I don't know why my hair is giving white talk. It is what it is. Okay, let's go. All right, y'all, we just filled up the gas tank at Costco. Now I'm going to go into Ulta because I really need some new skincare. My skin is just not skinning, so let's go to Ulta. Y'all, this perfume smells amazing. You need to go smell it. I really want to buy it, but I'm on my save money with Grind right now, so I'm going to wait. I'm going to try this. I keep seeing it all over my TikTok for you page, and it's actually really affordable at only 13 bucks. So I'm one of my favorite skincare brands, and I definitely want to try this one next. I don't need it right now. I'll leave it. But I love this. I use every day. I have not switched for a long time. And then I was using this for a while. And I really like this too. Y'all, I love how my Ulta points got it down to 216. So while we're especially on our money grind, I gave up a shift last week and ended up taking a three-day weekend. And then I had to pay for an oil change, which was 160. So a lower paycheck and an unexpected car thing. I, I have like $50 to spend this week. But it's the things where I always pay my tithing. I always pay um, money to God, money to church. That's a whole nother thing. Everyone does their own thing. And gas was the cheapest today that I've ever seen. And I literally have like, I have, I have savings, but I just don't want to dip into savings. My, out of my weekly spending, I have like probably $50 left, okay? And gas was the cheapest I've ever seen it here today. It was like 380 something. And I had enough points to pay for most of this. So it was like two bucks. And so it's like the little things, you know, and it always just strengthens my testimony of paying tithing. I know not everyone's gonna get it and I'm not trying to preach to it all, but it's just like the little things 
the little tender mercies of God that I like to point out and remember and recognize today. And yeah, I really am not feeling the gym, y'all, so I think I'm going to go home and make brekkie at 12.30 p.m. And I think I'm just gonna go for a walk and then get ready for the day. And then I also need to pluck my eyebrows really bad. <sighs> I also, yeah, I just have a couple to do things at home. I definitely don't want to stay at home the whole day, but we'll try to get out. Anyways, that's just my two cents right now. I'm so shook. I'm on my way home and I was like, mm, what like food things do I have that are like free? Because I'm just feeling so tired, like, I don't want to go home and cut up fruit and put it- I just- I just can't be out right now. A freaking large french fry from McDonald's is almost six dollars- no, almost five dollars, like, that's insane. But I used the app and only paid one thirty. I also had points to get a free cheeseburger. For a cheeseburger and a large fry for a dollar thirty, and I have my sodies at home. I just want to lay in bed, put something on, and then go back to sleep. I don't know if I said this last night, but my shift was changed today because we finished everything by two o'clock a.m. Today I'm going in at six. It's currently one. Y'all. I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna eat this, go on a walk, and go back in bed. I need some fresh air, you know? Okay. If you watched my video last week, you'll know that I got a laser hair remover for Christmas. And so, because I was feeling or I just want to turn the rest of the morning into a self-care morning. It's 2.30 and I have to leave for work at 5. So I'm going to laser myself up. I just shaved my whole body. And then we'll see what we do after that. In my last video, I was literally too afraid to use this. But now I know how. I did it once on the setting one. Maybe today I'll do setting two. I think that's how many like zaps I have left till it runs out and this was only $70 and there were YouTube videos of girls who had gone and gotten theirs professionally done and it didn't do as good of results and it was more expensive. It is kind of scary though, I'm not gonna lie. Some people just left my house. I've just been chilling, keeping it low key today. I wasn't as productive as I want, but I only slept for five hours. So, what can I expect? You know, and so I'm gonna get ready for work now. Gotta leave in 15 minutes. So, I will come back since I already got ready for work with you yesterday. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back after. I'm gonna wear the same exact thing as yesterday. Alrighty, y'all. I'm ready for work. I'm going to leave you here and I'll be back at. 2 3 a.m anyways guys i'm going to work i will catch you in a little bit i think i said my shift would change from eight start time to six start time so i'll be back a little sooner than last night thankfully y'all i'm so dead i once it hit 10 o'clock i was clocked out for the night and I think tomorrow I'm going to literally just stay in bed as long as I can. Like, I think I'm going to do like a half rotting day because oh, I'm not a night person. And I'm not a morning person either, honestly. I just can't sleep in. And I'm like a, I like to go to bed early and wake up early. I'm so dead. I think tomorrow I'm going to sleep, wait, be able to sleep, sleep way longer. But I do work at four tomorrow. And then I have a morning shift the night after. But I kind of like having my schedule all over. I kind of like it being more consistent, but also <laughs> it's nice not being stuck to a 9 to 5. Like, there's pros and cons to both. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Literally showed me everything in my closet and dealing with it tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe. And I'll catch you on my next 
video. Nighty.